Electronics. So, in this video, we are going to see a recruitment news from IREL, that is India Rare Earth Limited. And the location of uh, IREL Tamil Nadu, that is Kanyakumari district of Tamil Nadu, is recruiting. And the post is apprentice. And there is opening for ITI diploma and also for engineering graduates. That is, there is trade, technician, and graduate apprentice recruitment. Okay. So, let us see the post and the vacancy details first. We are going to see all details in this video, the selection procedure, the application procedure, everything we are going to see in this video. Okay, first let us see the post details. So, the first post is for trade apprentice, it is for ITI people and the branches they are recruiting are fitter with four vacancies, electrician with three vacancies, then PASA with one vacancy, Turner with one vacancy. The duration of training is for one year and the qualification you are requiring is you have passed this uh, ITA branch. That is a pass class is also only required. Okay. That is you, you should have passed the ITI in these respective branches. Next is graduate apprentice. For graduate apprentice, the qualification is B or B Tech. And the branches that, are, uh, that they are calling are civil and electrical. And for electrical, the qualification you are requiring is B in electrical and electronics and for civil the qualification is B in civil. The vacancy is one month vacancies each. Yeah. Next is for technician apprentice. It is for diploma people. The branches they are recruiting are mechanical and electrical and the qualification you are requiring is diploma in mechanical and diploma in electrical and electronics and the vacancy is for mechanical there is one vacancy and for electrical there is again one vacancy. And the duration is for one year again. So, all the branches, the apprentice uh, duration of job is for one year only. Okay. Next is the age limit. The minimum age limit is 18 years and the maximum age limit is 25 years. And also there is age relaxation for all the reserved categories as per Government of India Reservation rules. Okay. Then, and also they have mentioned that if you have uh, done previous apprenticeship uh, with the organization or with any Government of India organization, you are not eligible. Okay. So, uh, these all things they have mentioned in the notification and also this is a selection process. So, the selection process is actually very simple. You don't have to write any examination or you don't have to give any interview. The selection will be directly happening based on your percentage of marks that you are obtaining in your ITI diploma and in your B or BJAC. Okay. So, that is actually the selection process and also they will be following certain uh, preferences or certain weightages. Uh, and also they have mentioned uh, that is which all things they are giving more importance to or more preference to. Uh, in the notification okay so the selection process is actually very simple you just have to apply if you are getting qualified you will get the uh, information okay so that is the selection process now talking about the application procedure so for just uh, like any other apprenticeship job you have to first uh, apply to or you have to enroll yourself to the NATS portal that is mhrd nats.gov.in site first you have to enroll if you are uh, belonging to the graduate or diploma apprentice for the ITI people, you have to go to www.apprenticeshipintia.org and you have to enroll yourself. So that is the basic step or the first step that you have to do if you are interested in doing apprenticeship jobs. Okay. For ITI people, you have to go to www.apprenticeshipintia.org and for graduate and technician people, you have to enroll in mhrdnats.gov.in site. Then after enrolling, you can see your application form towards the end of this notification. Just take a printout of the application form, fill up, paste your photo and along with certain uh, documents, again taken as hard, hard copy, you have to send to the given address. Okay, so that is the application procedure. And the certificates or, or the documents that you have to at attach along with this application form are your 10 certificate, then your SCST or OBC certificate if you are applying or asking for any reservation, then income and asset certificate, nativity certificate, passport size photograph, 10 number, Aadhaar card copy, then your respective qualification certificate. So all these things you have to attach or you have to keep along with your application hard copy. Okay. So all these things should be in hard copy that is the printed format. Okay. And you have to uh, put all these things in an envelope and then send to the given address. So that is the application procedure and the last date for applying is 31st of December is the last date. So there is enough time but don't wait till that. Please go through the notification first. If you think that you are eligible, please do apply for it as soon as possible. Okay. 
So if you found this video useful, please do give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you want more videos, please do subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and keep on watching.